Registered dietitians are the nutrition experts hired by hospitals, long-term care, rehabilitation, and other medical facilities to ensure patients have the nourishment necessary to heal and recover. They are the only healthcare professionals to perform medical nutrition therapy and are required for all licensed hospitals and long-term care facilities. MNT is defined as the assessment of the nutritional status of patients with an illness, diet-related condition, or injury in order to benefit the patient's own health and reduce healthcare costs. It involves performing a comprehensive nutrition assessment, determining the nutrition diagnosis, planning and implementing a nutrition intervention using evidence-based nutrition practice guidelines, and monitoring and evaluating an individual's progress over subsequent visits. Like registered nurses, a registered dietitian must pass a national exam and maintain continuing ed education. However, the registered dietitian must first complete a master's degree and 1,200 hours of internship, which is equivalent to about one year, from an accredited organization before they can sit for the national exam. Each state also holds individual guidelines for licensure. Because nutrition involves the chemistry of the body and food, a clinical dietitian has extensive knowledge of all the body processes, diseases, treatments, and how the chemistry of food interacts with those. One of the biggest misconceptions about dietitians is that their primary function is to make meal plans. The truth is that almost never happens in hospitals or long-term care. Their roles vary depending on the situation. In a hospital or nursing home, the registered dietitian completes a full assessment to determine nutrition barriers and provide solutions based on what they were admitted to the hospital with. They utilize historical laboratory and physical data along with evidence-based research to diagnose, plan, and implement strategies to maximize nutrition and reduce both medical care costs and length of stay in the hospital. Keep in mind that inpatient is focused on the immediate problems of a patient, not long-term goals. Many medical facilities provide outpatient care from dietitians to provide ongoing nutrition support and education. Additionally, many dietitians own a business in which they provide nutrition counseling. Most of the outpatient services are focused on long-term goals to promote health. This is where the dietitian is likely to provide extensive education and meal planning. Dietitians never work in isolation. Whether inpatient or out, the dietitian is part of a healthcare team that often includes a nurse and doctor. In hospitals and long-term care, the nurse records weights, fluid intake and output, and oral intake from meals so that the healthcare team can ensure proper care is being met and medical goals are reached. They also identify allergies, religious food needs, dietary compliance, and physical or laboratory data that may relate to malnutrition. The nurse then consults the dietitian when appropriate and relays information between healthcare professionals and the patient. Physicians are ultimately responsible for the care of each patient. They write the orders for appropriate labs, procedures, and diet based on the condition that is presented in the hospital. However, you may have noticed that physicians often do not have much time with each patient, thus they rely heavily on the assessments of the healthcare team and confer with them to help diagnose and treat patients. Due to limitations in the number of dietitians, it's not unusual for the dietitian and doctor to not see each other. They must communicate through the medical records and the registered nurses. As you can see, the healthcare team is critical to best assess and treat patients. However, the nurse is the central caregiver that is always with the patient and has a significant function in communication between and among healthcare providers.